Morning. Uh, it's Tuesday. It's September the 12th. It's Andrew and Elaine here and we're live. Uh, now we're about to go on air very shortly, but this is our, our, our new thing. Uh, Facebook Live. That's our, our new thing. I know, it be so pretty. Uh, I, lo- I love doing <laughs> making videos at half six in the morning, by the way, Andrew. Look at my eyes. Uh, weather-wise today, it's going to be a bit of a weird one, a bit of a mix this morning. It's still quite dark outside. We're going to see a lot of cloud cover this morning and there's going to be a few heavy showers scattered right across the county this morning. There will be the odd of a sunny spell breakthrough, but generally it's going to be a wet day. Ooh. Wet and windy, actually, for the most part. We're checking out today's papers as well in a few minutes, in about 15 minutes or so. So some of the top stories in the front pages. Dreadful day on the country's roads yesterday. Uh, there's more about that in the front pages of our papers today. Mind yourselves out there today, guys. Get in touch if there's anything going on out and about in the roads that you think we should know about. Uh, the new uh, Garda Commissioner, who will that be? They'll have to be paid more money than Noreen O'Sullivan was, says the Irish Examiner. Top Garda job will need bigger salary, is their main headline in today's Examiner. Yeah, and the Irish Times also talks about that awful uh, accident in County Mayo yesterday. Uh, they also say that the um, the HPV vaccine left almost 650 girls requiring medical care. That's one of their headlines there this morning. And there's a headline in the Irish Mirror as well this morning. This says, desperate family plunged into homelessness, uh, plead for help after being forced to move into a caravan. That's one of their main stories. The family of six are sharing a cramped mobile home. That's their big story there in the uh, Irish Mirror this morning as well. And I was looking at some of the top trends. Have you heard of this TV show, Liar? No. No, it's this, apparently it's on ITV. I didn't know, I'd never heard of it until this morning, but... Uh, twists, turns plenty, and lots of theories about what's going on. That's what's trending this morning. The EU withdrawal bill passed uh, yesterday. It's first stage uh, in the UK. That's also trending. And West Ham, it says, finally a win for the Hammers. That was also trending this morning. Uh, see what I've written here? What? 104 <laughs> sleeps till Christmas Day. Woo! Yeah. I spotted yesterday somebody shared a video online that said it was 12 Mondays until Christmas. Oh, stop. When you, you, bre- you share that video well, online. It, well, I, I shared it afterward. But when you break it down like that, it's kind of a scary thought. Uh, and also today, we mentioned it on yesterday's show, Kelly, remember My Milkshake Brings All the Boys to the Yard? Yeah, remember it. Uh, well, today is uh, International Milkshake Day, Chocolate oh, yeah. Milkshake Day. We're having so. milkshakes. We have five grand to give away as well, guys. We're on air between seven and nine on Radio Kerry, and we'll talk to you in a few minutes. <laughs>